Welcome to the Hoosier Crane Help Center. In this video we are going to show you how to wire your crane. The most important part of wiring your crane is making sure you minimize the amount of dangling cables. Use zip ties to secure the pendant trolley and the hoist power and control festoons to their C-tracks. Carry the festoons over the cableway extension and feed them through to lay behind the support pieces. Secure the festoons to the cableway extension. Attach gaskets to the two hoist power and control connections and plug them in. The numbers on each plug should match the socket it connects to. Attach a gasket and plug in the pendant trolley festoon. Secure the cables to the back of the panel with zip ties. Secure the rest of the loose festoon to the cableway extension. Next, run the bridge motor cord across the C-tracks and over the cableway extension. Feed it behind the support pieces. Attach a gasket and plug the connection in. Secure the remaining cord to the cableway extension. To connect the second bridge motor festoon, you may need to saw off a part of the inside C-track. Slide the heat shrink sleeve to the end of the inside C-track and use a heat gun to secure it. Pull the bridge motor festoon over the second cableway extension and secure it in place. Feed the festoon behind the panel, attach a gasket, and plug it in. Grab the limit switch, attach a gasket, and plug that in. Lastly, grab the building power supply festoon, attach a gasket, and then plug it in. Place the cableway extension cover on and tighten it in place. Lastly, double check that there are no dangling cables. Your crane has now been wired correctly and is fully assembled for installation.